Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to King's Quest 3. Uh, we are back inside the uh, laboratory. I restore restored the game. Uh, let's go ahead and uh, teleport out of here. We will see about getting off of this accursed, out of this accursed land. Actually, you know what? Uh, let's uh, let's first uh, do something else that we haven't done. Da, 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 da. I'm sure we can get out this way, right? Whee! Hi, Buzzard. How's it going? Oh, hi, Skeleton. Eventually, I'll get out of here, right? That, uh... That dune is moving in the background. Actually, I wonder, uh, what the map shows. Oh, actually? It's interesting. You can actually, uh, teleport back using it. Oh no, the mountain in the background changed places. I could have sworn we'd die out here. Wait, seriously, game? You're not gonna kill me off? I, I came in here so you'd kill me off. Snake was trying to get me. Um, really? I could have sworn you'd die if you went, if you just kept going this way. Um, apparently not, though? I don't know. I wonder what happens when that, uh, oh, that thing doesn't keep shifting to the, uh, the right anymore. Huh. Man, Gwydion is pretty hardy, then. Pretty impressed. All right, well, screw that then. Um, I don't actually die out there. What's the point? All right, let's uh, magic map our way out of here. And so it shall be. It's not where I pointed. Well, yeah, let's uh. Take a look. Oh, hey! There's a boat! It's a boat. I'm sure they won't uh, get mad at me for calling it a boat rather than, you know, a ship. Alright, let's uh, climb back up here. Maybe they're in the tavern. Open door. One of the rowdy seamen yells to the barmaid, Witch! Come over here with some more rum! And so she does. Uh, talk to... Well, let's actually uh, look at them first. Look at men. The sailors have obviously been drinking heavily for some time and are very loud and rowdy. Look, Captain... Talk to... Captain. The sailors peer at you through bleary eyes and continue swilling their rum. One, who looks like the captain, pauses and drunkenly says, Aye, me bucko, be a wanton passage on me ship? What you running from? Ah, it's no matter. As long as you got gold. Let's me see how much you got. Give gold to Captain. As you bring out the purse, the captain snatches it from your hand and says, Aye, lad, I sees you do have a wee bit of gold. It's less than me regular fare, but I'll give you passage anyways. We'll be waiting for you at the wharf, but no for long, but not for long. The captain and his men down the rum in one long draft and then leave the tavern. Wow, they just poof, gone, vanish. Well, let's go ahead and uh, head this way. Uh, so I believe the, uh, the ship is here for 30 minutes of in-game time once you get to the Amber Stone, which I actually did not know about, so I'm kind of glad that I, uh, still did that la- I kind of forgot about getting the stone. Uh, kind of helps. Uh, admittedly, you can only get the stone after you figured out some magic, so, um, it's not so bad. Hi, guys! As the gangplank is drawn drawn in, you hear the captain shout to his men, 
take his things and put them in the hold until I figures out what to do with them. You have a sneaking suspicion that you have made a big mistake. These are pirates! Well, at least we're on a boat. It's a nice boat. Nothing like a little salt air to perk up a boy's spirits. All things have been all things being equal, you might have enjoyed this ocean voyage. Uh, however, you found your accommodations to be slightly less than satisfactory. Oh shucks. Uh let's actually uh take a look at our inventory. Oh no! All we are carrying is our dough in our ears. All right, mice, speak. Speak, mice, speak! You listen as two mice talk to each other. One says, I heard the pirates talking about bringing a cat on board. No, don't scare me like that, exclaimed the other mouse. Retorts the first, I mean it. They said there's getting to be too many mice on the ship. We need to call a mouse council and decide what to do about the situation. Speak, mice. I demand it. As your lord and master, I demand it. Uh, I uh, no, it's... We don't need to save again. You know the pirates buried treasure? You hear one of the mice say to the other. What about it? Asks the second mouse. Says the first. Well, I just heard the captain talking about it with one of his men. He said it was buried. Now, uh, let me see if I can remember. Oh, yeah, he said it was buried near a lone palm tree. From the palm, you walk five paces to the east and then start digging. Too bad we can't do anything about it, muses the other mouse. Ooh, buried treasure. That sounds fun. Speak, my speak! I demand it! What do you think the pirates will do with the boy they shanghaied? A little gray mouse squeaks to a companion. I'll probably make him a cabin boy, As answered the other mouse. What happened to the last cabin boy they had? Did you hear it? They fed him to the sharks just for sport. Let's see if you have anything else to say. Well, we definitely don't want to be fed to sharks. All right, mice. Speak. I demand it. Tell me your wisdom, oh mice of your something like that. I don't know where that went. No mice here? You have anything else to say? Nope. Alright, come on mice, speak. I demand it! Do you not have anything to say now? I say you don't have anything to say now. Get box. Hey, alright, we got a box! It's so awesome to have a box now. Drop box. All right, uh, let's go ahead and save real fast. Uh, what do we want to save it under? Temp four, I guess. That's sure, fine. Uh, jump on box. Jump on box. All right. Get box. Drop box. All right. Jump on box. There we go. Jump on box. And jump on ladder. All right. Let's, uh, let's make our way up. Uh, let's actually uh, save it again right here. So, uh, Mr. Pirates, how's it going? Ooh, look at the pretty, pretty... Oh, God, no! Whoops, you've unsuccessfully defied the law of gravity. I fought the law, and the law won. Alright. 
There we go. That's one way to get off the ladder. Oh no, one of the crew has spotted you. You'd better run. Hi, how's it going? The pirate growls, What are you doing snooping around me digs, laddie? I got you now, boy. Oh. You're just gonna put me there, huh? They'll take your stuff if you've gotten it back. Alright, I, I thought I'd be a little bit closer, but... Okay, whatever. Do, 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 do. Hmm. Go fishing. What's a fishing? <laughs> well, let's, uh, look. This must be the captain's cabin. He seems to be a bit more tidy than his mates, as the room is clean and orderly. Against one wall rests his bunk with a large chest at its foot. Across the room is his desk with a chart tacked to the wall. Look, chart. You stare at the chart tacked on the wall. It traces the route the ship is now sailing. It leaves Ludor crossing a wide ocean and arriving at the foot of a mountain range. An X has been marked at the arrival point. Uh, look, desk? You gaze with interest at the captain's desk. The desktop is very neat, holding only writing implements. Curiously, you open a drawer or two. There is nothing of interest among the charts and logbooks. Quickly, you close them again. Um, look, shelves, doesn't look interesting. Open chest. Look in chest, I was expecting a little bit more than that. You found all of your missing possessions, you take them with you. Yay, all of our stuff. Close. Well, let's uh, actually uh, look in chest again. Find. You look in the chest and find nothing. Close chest. Let's actually go ahead and save it again. Under uh, temp four. Sure, why not? All right, there is another item that we want. But first, let's look. You. You look curiously around. Out a porthole you see the swell of the ocean. A device for turning the ship's rudder sets in the floor. A rope ladder extends up through an opening in the ceiling. Look! You have found yourself below the lower deck. They keep the ship's lifeboat stored here. There are open doorways at either end of the compartment. There is a shovel lying by the lifeboat. Well, let's take... Shovel. Excellent. I have taken the shovel. Look. This is where your average pirate sleeps. Actually, those bu bunks don't look much more comfortable than your own miserable cot used to be. And the space is just as cramped. Alright, well, uh... That's good to know. Alright, uh, let's go ahead and save it again. Climb on ladder. How can you do that? Excellent. It just does it automatically. I want to be, uh, I want to play it safe. Uh oh. Aha. This is the galley of the pirate ship. A large iron stove dominates one wall. Pots, pans, and barrels surround it. There's a long dining table at the other end of the room. Excuse me. Look. This is the upper deck of the pirate ship. A ladder leads to the lower deck. That is some very odd climbing animation. Uh oh. Oh god, no, get away, get away. Ha ha! I escaped him. I actually didn't know that they'd uh, come on like that. 
Oh god, uh oh. Oh, wow. She's surprised that uh, did not kill me. Now that might kill me. Yeah. That killed me. <laughs> That's okay. Let's uh just get down there. There we go. All right. Now at this point, uh we're just kind of going to wait for uh stuff to happen. You going to say anything else, mice? Let's uh give them a little bit. Uh, what else we can do, actually, is, uh, let's see, well, let's take a look at the shovel. The shovel seems to be quite average, with an iron scoop and a long wooden handle. Uh, what we can also do is, uh, take a look at the magic map. Press F6 to teleport. Press F8 to put the map, the map away. Route to Daventry. How does the map know? Well, this is, uh, where we are, um... And so it shall be. Uh, let's actually go ahead and uh, take another quick save and see if we can teleport. Can I teleport down here? F6. And so it shall be. Uh oh. Oh, great. I'm in the water. Hmm. Well, shucks. Hi, fishies. So, uh, this wasn't quite what I was expecting. I was kind of hoping to get a little bit closer. You've reached the limits of your strength. Alright, uh, how about we restore? Uh, rub stone. Oops. Rub stone. Huh. Well, that's fun. Sploosh. <laughs> this is actually kind of amusing. Wow, we ended up in the exact same place. So this is literally just teleporting at random. Um, there we go. That's not where I want to go, though. Well, at least we teleported onto the ladder. Hey, uh, why do you think that human keeps popping in and out of existence here? Hello. <laughs> Excuse me. Didn't. Don't mind me. Seriously, you're going to put me in the exact same place? This is literally just teleporting at random. You actually can get off the uh, the ship this way, get to uh, Daventry. Um, as you can see, it's not exactly the best way to do it, but... Uh, yeah... Alright, let's, uh, let's go ahead and restore the game, since before I did all that, just to be on the safe side. Alright, so... Um, if we take a look at the magic map, this will uh, tell us where we are. We are about right there. Uh, we want to keep an eye on it. Um, won't teleport. And uh, at this point, we uh, just kind of have to uh, wait and uh, wait for something to happen. So that's what I'm going to do. I'll pick up the uh, episode... Um, back when we are, uh, well, when that event happens, or maybe at least when we're closer to our destination. So I shall see you in the next episode.